Hi everyone, welcome back. In this video, we are going to look at the top 10 Maven interview questions and answers. If you are preparing for a Java or Spring Boot interview, Maven is one of the most essential tools you must understand. It controls your builds, manages dependencies and organizes your project's structure. Let's begin. Question 1. What is Maven? Maven is a build automation and dependency management tool used mainly in Java projects. It helps you compile code, run tests, package your application, and manage external libraries. Maven uses a standard project layout, which makes every Java project look organized and predictable. Every behavior in Maven is controlled by a single configuration file called pom.xml, which stands for Project Object Model. Maven saves time, avoids dependency conflicts, and ensures your application builds the same way on every machine. Question 2. What is pom.xml? The pom or project object model is the heart of any Maven project. This file contains all configuration details. It includes dependencies, plugins, build settings, project metadata, repository configuration, versioning, packaging type, and more. Whenever you run a Maven command, Maven reads the POM file, builds a dependency graph, and executes the required goals. Think of POM as the master blueprint of your project. Question 3. What is the Maven build lifecycle? Maven has three built-in lifecycles, but the most common one is the default lifecycle, which handles the entire build process. The default lifecycle contains many phases, such as validate, compile, test, package, verify, install, and deploy. Each phase does a specific job. Compile compiles the source code. Test runs unit test. Package creates a jar or war file. Install puts the package into the local repository. Deploy pushes it to a remote repository. When you run a single phase, Maven automatically runs all previous phases. For example, if you run MV and package, Maven will run validate, compile, and test before packaging. Understanding this lifecycle is very important in interviews. Question 4. What is the difference between MVN clean, MVN install, and MVN package? This question appears in nearly every interview, so here is a clean explanation. MVN clean deletes the target directory. The target directory stores compiled classes, jars, and temporary files. Clean ensures your next build starts fresh. MVN package compiles your code and generates the final package output, such as a jar or war file. MVN install does everything package does, plus it installs the built artifact into your local repository. Your other Maven projects can then use it as a dependency. In simple terms, Clean removes old builds. Package builds the application. Install makes your build available locally for other projects. Question 5. What are Maven repositories? Repositories are storage locations where Maven keeps artifacts such as jars, plugins, and metadata. There are three types of repositories. First is the local repository. This is on your own machine. When you download dependencies, they are stored here. Second is the central repository. This is maintained by Maven and contains thousands of commonly used libraries like Spring, Hibernate, and Log4j. Third is the remote repository. Companies host their own remote repositories such as Nexus or Artifactory. These are used to share internal artifacts across teams. Maven searches in this order, local, remote, then central. Question 6. What are Maven dependencies and dependency scopes? Dependencies are external libraries your project needs. You declare them inside pom.xml with a group ID, artifact ID, and version. Maven has different dependency scopes that define where and how dependencies are available. Compile scope is the default. It makes the dependency available at compile time and runtime. Provided scope means the dependency is available during compilation but will be provided by the environment at runtime. This is common for servlet APIs in web apps. 
Runtime scope is only needed when running the application. Test scope is only available in the test phase. Understanding these scopes helps avoid version conflicts and reduces the size of your final jar or war. Question 7. What is the Maven wrapper? The Maven wrapper allows you to run Maven even if Maven is not installed on your system. It downloads the exact Maven version required by the project. This ensures that everyone on your team uses the same Maven version. It also helps achieve consistent builds across local development, CI pipelines and production environments. The wrapper is highly recommended for real-world projects. Question 8. What are Maven plugins? Plugins extend Maven's functionality. Each plugin contains a set of goals that perform tasks such as compiling code, copying resources, running tests, packaging the project, or deploying to a server. For example, the Maven compiler plugin compiles Java code, the Maven Surefire plugin runs test, the Maven jar plugin packages your application as a jar. Spring Boot also provides the Spring Boot Maven plugin, which adds features like building executable jar files and running the application directly. Plugins make Maven flexible and powerful for modern application development. Question 9. What is the difference between a parent POM and a child POM? In Maven, you can create a hierarchy of POM files. A parent POM contains shared configuration, dependency versions, plugin management, and build settings. Child projects can inherit all these settings using inheritance. This reduces duplicate code, keeps versioning consistent, and simplifies large multi-module projects. For example, in microservices, each service may have its own POM, but all services inherit from a shared parent POM. Question 10. What is dependency management in Maven? Dependency management allows you to define versions of dependencies in the parent POM without including them in the child's class path. Child modules can then declare the dependency without specifying the version. This ensures all modules use the same version of a library, which is crucial in large teams. Dependency management is one of Maven's most powerful features because it eliminates version conflicts and maintains consistency across projects. Let's quickly summarize. In this video, you learned the most important Maven interview questions, including what Maven is, how the poem works, the build lifecycle, common commands, dependency scopes, repository structure, parent child poem inheritance, plugin usage, and dependency management. If you understand these questions deeply, you will be ready for any Java or Spring Boot interview. Maven is simple but extremely powerful and mastering it will make your development workflow smoother and more reliable. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.